After testing many microphones, I've decided I prefer the low noise sound coming from Dynamics. Dynamic microphones. So far, my favorite is this Electrovoice RE20. I'm hold, hardly alone in loving this mic, by the way. I'm using this microphone with Shure's MVX2U. It's a USB to audio interface, which I plugged into my phone. The MVX2U isn't specifically made to work with phones. That it does work is quite useful. For most of my phone videos, I've been using condenser mics like this inexpensive one from Cubelix. I have no real complaints. I also believe many listeners would prefer listening to me on this rather than a dynamic microphone. Point is, there is no best microphone. It's all personal preference. Now, this is the Shure uh, SM11 dynamic uh, lavalier microphone. And uh, I'm about to plug it in to the MVX 2SU, 2US, 2SU. <laughs> So you can hear it, and we're going to go to it now. Because I can't use my RE20 while walking around talking to my phone, I did some research and discovered that the only dynamic, not condenser lavalier microphone manufactured for this purpose is the Shure SM11, which I'm using right now. I can see why there's a little desire for these microphones. They require powerful preamps, they're larger than condenser mics, much, much larger. They have deeper bass responses, which can make the voice sound dull. But the good thing about the MVX2U is you can configure it when using it on a PC or Mac. That is, you can add compression limiters and manually adjust the dynamic gain. It isn't the greatest software, but they're going in the right direction. The downside to the MVX2U is that you can't adjust anything with your phone. At least I don't know how to. That said, I'd probably leave it on auto anyway. In conclusion, if you want to use a dynamic microphone with your phone, this combination seems to work be the best at the moment. I wasn't able to get it to work with the inexpensive Pile XLR to USB interface, but I was able to get it to work with the uh, Zoom uh, U22, and it worked pretty well. So again, I'm just going to show this to you. This is Shure SM11 plugged into the Shure um, MVX2U um, XLR to USB interface and it's going straight into my phone and so uh, yeah for me I, I'm gonna I, I, I like this the best but as I pointed out before this $18 Cubelix is totally fine <laughs> anyway I hope you enjoyed listening to these comparisons any questions let me know in the comments